Okay, but what if this guy's just, I just can't get to the wrist. Um, so to be able to crash this side harder, sometimes I want to go claw. Okay, like I was saying before, weather the storm a little bit for the round, and then you can ride it. Okay, because this guy's going to come blessing it. The whistle blows. Oh, first move, coach yelling at him, all that stuff. You pick him up, put him down, 15 seconds, then he's like, oh, I'll get him. Not everybody, but a lot of the time. So, boom, I can't get it. See, so I dip, got to drop my shoulder. Okay, here, I got the claw. Now, now, now he's not going to be as strong. I'm going to still flank here, I pry, and I'm going to get him to the elbow to the mat. Okay, so then I'm just going to go to the wrist. Now, I'm all ball game. on. Okay. Just so you know, when you have the claw, okay, this isn't comfortable for him. Sometimes you think you got to be doing something. You don't have to do that much. Let's say he's tripoding. I love tri uh, clawing from a tripod. Side pry. I just walk towards his head slowly. What's happening to him? He's getting choked. Okay. And yeah, then he goes, "I'm not gonna be there anymore." Right. So he's got out of position. So I'm here, can't get it. Here, run him all the way to that wrist. Get at the elbow to his mat, or the mat. Go to the wrist. Now I'm here again, okay? Um, like I said about the tripod. He's tripoding. Okay, this is kind of an annoying position, right? Be your guy on top. My claw, you don't gotta do anything stupid. I'm just gonna thigh pry, walk towards my claw, slowly. All my weight onto the, onto the claw. He's gonna say, that's not working, I'm getting choked. Go to something else. Then you have a wrist. Okay? So, let's say um, Daniel's my size. Oh, he wishes. And he comes up, he, I, you know, and he's just, he fights through that. He's man child, gets to his feet. Okay? Oh my god. Now, my hips are in, and I'm squatting. I'm not out like this, okay? Squat. Now, I'm just gonna reach. I'm gonna lift correctly. I'm not gonna lift here uh, without momentum that way, right? If I just sit here and just, oh, that's hard, and he only weighs 150. Okay? I gotta be running him that way. I'm not, so I'm momentum. Okay? He's a little light. Usually, he's gonna land on his side. Gotta land on my side. Yeah. But I can't do all the so I'm walking and I'm gonna swing this leg out. Okay. No, that's good. Okay, so now here we are again. One thing I wanna add I'm not halfing here. This is uh, not that good. Okay. He can scramble here, like I was saying before, I could just turn in and look into the half. Yeah. I don't want to, do, I don't need that. I'm just here, same, same position, over the arm, walk it up, you can fish here if you want, I would. Okay? I want to talk about the lift though real quick. Don't make it harder than it is. This isn't like one rep back squat, like ah! Shouldn't be. I'm just hip popping and running. Okay? <laughs> Be quick, be explosive. If I try to lift slow, way harder. Okay, near, hip hop, walk. Ah. Here, you flip. This actually happened to me, Ryan Bertie, in the Vegas finals. It was from this position now. Here, he's running here. Ah. Hey, Ryan, you're probably like 20 feet. Gave up five, couldn't come back. I used the D1 national champ twice. What I'm saying is, you can score a lot of points right here. Don't make it hard though. Hip pop, walk. Post my hand. Post the hand. Don't be stupid and get rolled through. <laughs> 